morning everybody. Yesterday, we actually had a surprise delivery at the aquarium that we hadn't seen yet. Let's go check it out. Oh crap. <laughs> Come on Cameron. <laughs> they didn't want to run across the busy road with a baby? Probably not the smartest thing. <laughs> what are you doing here, dude? Cutting some wood. Ooh, what is this for? The boat, the boat tank that came in yesterday. Perfect. Oh, I saw a little glimpsy glyphs. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. There's a That's lot going on. All right, Cam, you just stay here real quick. We're gonna go. Just go around. Test dance driving skills. All right. Even when there's nothing to bump in this stuff. You're better than me. I was just literally just gonna lift him up and carry him over. Well, so that was my thought process too. Oh, no, nope. looks like it's my plan. It would have been easier just to take him. <laughs> there's also a ladder. <laughs> this is a construction zone. Why is there a baby here? Sorry, just a little baby. Wow, it looks so, so good without the stuff on it. Is this the one from the other day that they were bringing Yeah. In? It looks so good. Why isn't it, it uh, up into the... Yeah, it looks really it good, but that's what I'm looking at it. Like, it's bigger than the opening. How did it even get in there? That's a good point. That looks got a good team. <laughs> <laughs> but it's still a problem. Hmm. I guess it's going to be set back a little bit. No, it can't be set back there. We need a back in the house. We're going to have to redo this wall again. <laughs> Big Ron. Like, five, well, seven, It might be ten. ten. <laughs> yeah. Times. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Yeah. You're gonna have to do cut out. Yeah, cause or... look at it goes what a probably wall. like oh. this much further. Have to see which side he wants to do it, but that's a lot. Like, yeah. that's... <laughs> That is a lot. It is beautiful though. <laughs> I love it. I actually love it. I think it's my favorite part too. about it is that <laughs> it, it's black around the sides and nothing's popping. What? He's mad that there's that they don't That fit. they have to cut the yeah. wall. Yeah, yeah, we like, all feel that way. Yeah. But also, who's surprised? <laughs> this is going to be stellar. This might be one of my favorites. Real coral, okay. real anemones. Real, real fish. fish. <laughs> real fish. Okay. That should be the that, that should be the aquarium. Logo? <laughs> no. no the coral, catchphrase. Real coral, fish. real anemones, real fish. That's good. <laughs> Legacy. I don't think that's new, but that's crazy right there. Because of that other tank that came, we're able to set a lot of stuff. So this is like where it's going to be roughly. Oh. Oh, so good. Same awesome. with this back here. Yeah. Oh, they're in their real life. Whoa. Yeah. That's they might cool. be tweaked a little, but yeah, that's what that's they had said. So now you kind of oh, get a feel wow. of what the walkthrough will be without the scissor oh. lift. And then, well, is that right <laughs> Oh, we got Oh, wow. Oh, so cool. I don't know how the bathrooms are so cool. <laughs> wow. But isn't the handicap, handicap stall is the shower stall? Yes. Well, that was another problem, and this was the solution. Dude, you know what would have been a dope? Freaking aquarium would have been a British telephone booth. Red telephone booth. That would have been kind of freaking cool. <laughs> Anyways, what's this option? And that's why he wasn't on the design crew. <laughs> <laughs> be cool. This is really cool from this angle. This is actually, yeah, because you really cool. And you know, like, everything is not even here yet. Like, there's tanks that aren't even in that. Yeah. You know that euphoria after, like, you drop the Browns off at the Super Bowl? <laughs> that euphoric feeling? And then you come out in here, it's like double euphoria. Oh my gosh. Is it? Yeah. Is that it? Ooh, when it's interesting start? looking. Watch oh, out for that. Gosh. <laughs> we didn't break the pipe before, we would have now. Yeah. Look at it. Whoa, it's got a very interesting shape to it. Oh, well, like, yeah. Very cool. It is very cool, because I can tell you one thing. When you do different shapes like this on the aquariums, like when your dad and I were going, it gives you such a different visual of the inside of the tank, and it, it's just so cool. So just changing that gives it a whole different look, which is so cool. Is this acrylic? This is Italian acrylic? This is Texas acrylic. Texas acrylic. <laughs> oh, God. Little sneak peek of the coral insert. Is there a coral in there? insert in there? Yeah. Mm -hmm. is it oh, cool? yeah, there it is. Oh, wow. That's cool. This is made with like. So cool biscuits and gravy. The cool thing about this tank is that this is holding up a lot of the stuff over there from being like finally set. So now that we have this here, pretty much once Alex sets it, then everything can really start going to its final places and the aquarium can get that much closer to opening. First, we gotta fix the reef tank wall. Because we gotta break it and then fix it. Yep. So yes, there's a little bit of a problem here, but what's the saying you say? It's like, everything I, is everything. Everything is everything, yeah. I like to go on runs, and sometimes it's a tough run, and the only way you get through it, just looking at that corner and being like, all right, I got a long way to go, but let me just get to this corner, and so on and so forth. The long run would be opening this aquarium, right? If you just break it down, it's like, okay, this is a problem. Well, let's just focus on one thing at a time, right? Like one little battle. In that battle, we gotta fix this wall and get it in there. It makes it less overwhelming. It makes the whole process of opening this aquarium a lot easier rather than being freaked out about, oh, I got all this stuff to do. It's just like, all right, get one corner at a time. This next corner is having Ron break this wall again. <laughs> okay. Look at that. What is that? 
wonder where that stuff's going. So the, right now, guys, they're actually building like a oh. an impromptu convection oven. Yes. So they'll put this like oh. one on one side, one on the other side, and then use heat guns to heat up the acrylic. To like make a sealer? To, or? Yeah, they have to what they call anneal. Because every time you mess with acrylic, chains break, and we need to get those chains as smooth as possible, or when we seem it, it's gonna look ugly. No, no, don't touch it. Oh my God, why is the koi pond water leaking? Who's behind this? I don't know, guys. Something seems real fishy about this. I've literally been pondering where Jeff's been. Get it? <laughs> That's good. I got that one. <laughs> okay, when you get in the water, we're gonna make a terrible pun. A really a bad log. dad joke. It's a really he's a bad new dad, dad, so he's testing him out. I got you. Yeah. The right. joke is you're gonna be in there, and we're gonna be like, man, we've been waiting around for so long. <laughs> he didn't even get it. I need to figure out what's going on here. It looks like Jeffrey is stealing all my dang water. Dang, Jeff, you gonna make me wait around all day? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. No, you get it? Like, get it? Wait, wait, or, wait around. around. Ah, I'm a little slow this morning. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> What's going on? You're stealing all the water, man? We need that for the fish. My portable hot tub. That sounds nice. So what are we doing today? We're gonna get this cleaned and up and yeah. running for you guys. Yeah. Okay, I see you got some nets. You gotta take the fish out? Yeah. Okay, can I help you out with that? Can I grab yeah. the fish? Heck yeah. Get you all wet and dirty and full of algae. Hey, yeah. like you. <laughs> you okay with that? <laughs> Today we actually have to deep clean the pond. Over winter, a lot of algae buildup, a lot of koi poop. Forgot what that word was. Lee told me the other day. So, it was detritus. A lot of detritus buildup. We're gonna help net some koi out of here, and then I'm gonna leave Jeff to the dirty work. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> oh, are they are they all filled up? Yeah, we're all filled up. We're almost ready to get fish. The moment we've all been waiting for. <laughs> that was good. Dun dun! Let's do exactly what he's doing, but the opposite. Yes, and then stretch it out like that? Yeah. Here we go. I've never done this before. Dad would be so proud of you, know. All right, open up that end. And just kind of like do this. Yep. Because the back opens up. Oh! Yep. There we go, baby! That's so dumb. One down? 50 to go. <laughs> really? And some of those other corners that we've been talking about, it's stuff like the Stingray tank and a couple of the other tanks that have been leaking. Well, the crew came out, they sealed it all up, redid it, and now the tanks are holding water. It could have got overwhelming. You, you have to kind of take a step back, reevaluate your situation, because if you're always just in it, it can you can lose your mind, honestly. And another one of those problems is getting a stroller through all these tubes. It can be very overwhelming. But so unfazed. There you go. <laughs> Just like that. It's easy. Get through it. Another one of those things is this. We had this bridge tank here. We thought that it was just going to be fine. We would just be able to pick it up, plop it on the thing, and seal it, and then you're good. We unsheath it. We find out that it was decimated in scratches. I mean, it was it was really bad. Alex's team, you know, dedicated a lot of time to just <laughs> buffing it out. It's a little dusty now because there's a lot of work going on, but scratches should be gone. This looks like abstract art, like a spider webbing. But one of those problems was actually this wall was leaking. That was a bit of a disaster. Honestly, they had to do a lot of work, but we're not coy when it comes to problems. All right, fish number two, and we're gonna open up, kind of get them out here, right here. But this is so exciting because it is springtime here in Michigan. We have all four seasons, meaning we've just been in winter forever. Spring means flowers, plants, life. Not only are we cleaning this pond, coming around pretty soon here, we're gonna be able to plant this out for the first time ever. It's gonna be like a jungle in the front of here. I don't even know what it's gonna look like. I'm super excited. We got some more fish to catch. When I woke up today, I did not expect to be a fish runner. Oh yeah. It's a good day. I remember when we actually got these Ohio Fish Rescue. It's crazy to see how far they came. And if I'm not mistaken too, it's at a big the, one. Oh, it's a big one. Pondzilla. I think there's actually a bunch more fish that are going to be Inserted in that pond. What's the one inside? I'm trying to make sure the fish don't come this way. Why's that? So it's easier to catch them over there. They're all hiding underneath the bridge. So if we can get them over there towards these guys, they'll get them a little bit better. Hopefully, maybe end of summer, early fall. Okay. We're trying our best. It's yeah, just there's a lot of hiccups. Got a bunch of new tanks in yesterday and the day before. Get those all st installed, and then we got floors to work on. I have a granddaughter that lives in Iowa. She's 21, and her and Brian. They were two pieces of So she can't wait for this to open. She'll come down. We can't wait to have you. Yes. We'll see you soon. All right, thank you. How many fish are we on? Uh, maybe seven. I think we have 43 more to go. out on me. Wow. I think this is a much better experience. This will be very interactive for the people that visit. Yeah, the Koi hot tubs. The Koi hot, ooh. Might be a market for that. 
get the URL. Yeah, we're gonna have to get that URL. And guys, I'm not gonna lie, it's so cool seeing Noah help get all these fish out and ready for the pond to be clean because I can remember Brian getting these fish out of the truck from Ohio Fish Rescue and how excited he was getting these fish in this pond. I mean, it's weird. It's like a weird juxtaposition to see Noah doing this, but I absolutely love it. You know, I couldn't be more proud of him and all of us really that are trying to carry this legacy. It's a special day doing this and it's really special to see Noah helping out. Ooh, different net. <laughs> I think that's all the fish, Noe. I don't know. I just start blasting. How oh, much fun! All right. I'll let you guys get back to work. You just started. Sorry. <laughs> Those of you that don't know, Jeff Han season has started, so that's why you haven't seen him as much. But thanks again, dude, for helping as always. You You're, literally are the best. I love you, man. I love, I love you, man. man. We do miss, miss him so much. So drop a comment, drop some love for Jeff. Always helping us out. We appreciate you so much. So cool to see all the koi in here, and it's gonna be amazing to see that pond finish up tomorrow. I think this is a problem that Jeff's gonna have to solve. But honestly, escaping Jeff's grips right here is a corner that I'm gonna have to solve. I'm gonna get out of here. Noah, you forgot us! Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, there's a playlist that you can watch all kinds of videos. You can also hit that subscription button. It would mean a lot to me. Also, hit that like button while you're down there. Have a wonderful day, Reptile Army. Remember, be kind to someone, and I promise I'll see you in the next one.